Hi guys, today I'm going to be showing you how to install Ice Cream Sandwich version 4.0.4 .4 on the LG Optimus 1. So, this is a tutorial on how to install the custom ROM of Ice Cream Sandwich, and therefore, you will need a rooted LG Optimus 1 with new baseband and clockwork mod recovery. So, first, we're going to need to do a wipe of the data factory reset. Actually, a wipe of everything except for the battery status and the partition of the uh, SD card you do not need to wipe the SD card so we we'll need to wipe Dalvik and once everything has everything has been wiped then we we'll go into install zip from SD card and you need to have this the ROM that you're planning on installing already on your SD card and we'll go to choose zip from SD card so you need to place the zip on the SD card and here you can see I have three ice cream sandwich ROMs one is AOKP which is Android Open Kang project and this really allows a lot of customization this ROM AOSP is basically a stock ice cream sandwich kind of ROM so there's not and much difference between this and the stock ice cream sandwich and then there's Cyanogen Mod 9 ice cream sandwich ROM which is basically a pure performance ROM so I'm going to install AOKP because I'm really fond of the customizations that it offers and we will install AOKP and this might take a while As you can see this is in fact the LG Optimus 1 and I will put links on all the three ROMs in the description so you can download and view screenshots of the ROMs I might even make videos on each of the ROMs separately although I already have made a video on Cyanogen Mod 9 ROM but this is an updated version and I believe a lot of things have been fixed a lot of bugs including the camera but there is still no cam there is still no video recording this is really going to take a while because of the ROM being large okay so we're finished with the installation of the ROM now what we're going to need to do is install G apps which is Google Apps and that will have, that will allow you to install things like Google Play and other um, Google applications so without this you will not have Google Play market on your phone so you need to install this for the basic Google apps to be on your phone and through that you can install many apps this might also take a minute or so To get Clockwork Mod Recovery, once you are rooted, you can download it from the Play Store and you need to install the new baseband version. So we are done now and what we will do is reboot system now. And If everything has been done correctly, you should now have Ice Cream Sandwich running on your LG Optimus 1. This is the first boot so it will take longer than the regular for the regular boot time of your ROM 
this is just the first boot so it will take longer Okay, and this is a new animation if you remember I installed the Android open Kang project ROM so this is the boot animation for it and as I said the first boot takes longer than usual so we're just gonna have to wait for some time This is the logo of the AOKP ROM. This is a unicorn, a pink unicorn. I can just get it to focus on the logo. There we go. Now you can see. See the logo properly. And I think I'll do a video of this ROM so that you guys can see how the ROM works. If you guys remember my Cyanogen Mod 9 video, Ice Cream Sandwich development for this phone has really come quite a long way from there. And now we have all sorts of numerous ROMs. Back then we just had one developer developing ROMs for the phone and now there are about three to four different ice cream sandwich ROMs out on XDA so you can go there and check them out this is really taking more time than I expected okay guys I don't think this is gonna boot in time so I'll see you next time.